Hey everybody, welcome to Build Fly Go. So some good progress this week. Uh, one of the big things that we worked on was getting the bends finished uh, on these skins. You'll notice that we have the Ford fuselage skins on the table. Um, I believe we're working on the left one first. And uh, a big chunk of this is getting these bends done. You'll notice that there's, uh, there's a bunch of clamps and that chunk of wood and there's a very specific curve that vans want you to put on on that in a very specific place you'll see we're we're sort of muscling it into place and slowly getting that bend there there it's almost done there you can see and uh, numerous clamps um and it's Honestly, this is a pain. This is worse than the the longer on bends that people complain about. The longer on bends are a piece of cake. This is really a pain, um, and partially because messing it up is fairly easy, and it's not you know it, it, I don't know it's it's complex and wasn't great, but we got that in place. The big cool thing of this week is there's a new camera. Uh, we've got a much wider lens on this camera, and it's uh, the resolution is not quite 4K, uh, but it is close. I think it's just it's bigger than 2K, but it's not quite 4K. Um, so let me know in the comments what you think. Do you like this wider view? You see a lot more of my mess for sure. Um, you might be able to zoom in and even see what's on the plans here, which is pretty cool. Um, and you can definitely see what I'm watching on TV. So bonus points if you can tell me which episode of DS9 is coming on. Um, <laughs> it's usually DS9 that I'm watching. But anyway, so here we go. So those skins are on. And uh, that one got deburred and basically got sorted out. The left got sorted out. All, everything gets drilled. At this point, we're drilling the long runs. We're drilling everything, basically, onto those skins. Um and uh, you get everything drilled and then you pull the skin off and then you start countersinking stuff. Um, you're going to notice, yep, you're going to notice that I'm going to start countersinking. Oh, well, okay, I'm drilling some of the, the angle pieces there still. But uh, you'll notice I'll start countersinking the longer ons and, and uh, the F1040 and F1041, which are those sort of C channels on the front that transfer a lot of the, the load from the, the firewall mounts to the rest of the airplane. But uh, there we go. So this was a pretty good amount of progress this week. I'm almost to the point where I have to prime all of these parts now. Um, I've gotten uh, all of the parts off and uh, the two forward skins you'll notice coming up um, get dimpled. Um, it's it's sort of fun to watch uh, as I'm working on the plane, the fuselage shifting in its cradle or the cradle moving, right? The cradle's on uh, wheels, so um, they'll just move along as I push it. Uh, you'll notice at one point I'm sitting, yeah, you, at one point I'm sitting down and it's slowly moving away from me. You can see in the time lapse. Um, but anyway, <laughs> so uh, yeah, there it is. Um, and that's me countersinking stuff. You'll notice, yep, I, I countersink the parts on the plane because they're already mounted and it's just easy to uh, see where things are. And also they're sort of firmly in place, right? So there's, um, I, I don't have to mount it on something or, you know, I could just do it floating because it's supported on both sides. Uh, I need to actually go back through this video. I lost one of the little brackets uh, that hold those C channels, and I kept, I've looked for them and I could not find them. Um, so uh, I guess a cool bonus of the higher resolution of video is I can see maybe if I grabbed it and put it down somewhere, <laughs> hopefully. Um, but anyway, so okay, so the skins are coming off and uh, everything is getting countersunk and sort of final holes drilled uh, for the longer ons. The longer ons get shortened there. They're supposed to be a specific length past the uh, last uh, rivet hole. And um, it was sort of tricky to countersink some of the parts on uh, the brackets. They're a little tight, but uh, you'll see that I am now sort of prepping to get everything dimpled, right? Like I cleaned off the table and lots of breaks, um, I cleaned off the table and started dimpling things and I'm going to get the dimpling table up. Yep, there we go. And get the rest of them done. So I have the two forward skins done and uh, tomorrow I will get to do the two rear skins.
All right. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think about the camera. We'll talk soon.